Hey guys, this is going to be a quick step into the Jones Zone, and um, it's going to be about Halloween. So, for those of you who are wondering if it's biblical to celebrate Halloween or not, uh, let me just say that you're not going to find scripture in the Bible explicitly stating that Christians should not celebrate Halloween. However, what you do have are scriptures that do not condone evil or darkness. For example, uh, in Ephesians chapter 5, starting at verse 8, it reads, for you were once darkness, but now you are light in the Lord. Walk as children of the light, for the fruit of the Spirit is in all goodness, righteousness, and truth. Finding out what is acceptable to the Lord. And have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness, but rather expose them. Now, of course, you're going to have people in denial who are like, Well, what's so dark about kids having on innocent costumes and eating candy? Well, uh... What do ghosts, vampires, and fairies have in common? They're all demonic spirits. Is that something children of light should be celebrating? Demons? Really? And I know there'll be some of you uh, intellectual Christians out there who will try to justify this with, well, they can dress up as angels or you know something good for Halloween. Okay, well, uh, let's take a look at uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 21. You cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of demons. You cannot partake of the Lord's table and of the table of the demons. So, even if you try and add some light into this evil pagan tradition that is Halloween, you're still partaking in darkness. You cannot do that. I mean, what do you think Jesus would say about you dressing up your little ones as fallen angels and having them roam around begging heathens and lukewarm Christians for candy? Uh, let's take a look at Matthews chapter 18 verse 6 but whoever causes one of these little ones who believe in me to sin it would be better for him if a millstone were hung around his neck and he were drowned in the depth of the sea this is why as a Christian you have to develop a sense of spiritual discernment to know what is good and evil to do this you have to have a relationship with God through prayer and he'll reveal these things to you you can't be a spiritually dry intellectual Christian who doesn't believe in demons or the supernatural because you're you're just you're not gonna make it. it. It doesn't matter how many books you've read or how many facts you can retain in your mind. At the end of the day, you'll be given over to every kind of wicked thing because it's popular or because uh, so and so intellectual contemporary thinks it's okay. And it's that kind of stuff that'll cost you your salvation that you'll end up in outer darkness. And the more logical you are the more of a surprise it'll be for you when you get there. Okay, so having said that, Christians should absolutely not be celebrating Halloween. Hope this helps, and uh, you guys have a blessed day.